I guess before we go any further with our banjo lessons, we ought to talk a little bit about tuning. There's an awful lot of ways to tune banjo. That's one of the things that makes them so interesting. Uh, what's kind of standard or the thing that people play the most is G. G is basically uh, on the fifth string. It's uh, G, D on the fourth string, G on the third string, B on the second string, and D on the first string. Now don't let that make you crazy because the first time I ever heard that I didn't have a clue what a G was from a Z. <laughs> But what I did learn is the, what's called relative tuning. If you uh, fret your banjo at the fourth fret, I mean the fifth fret, that's right there usually where the tuning peg is, then the fourth string and the third string should sound alike. Something like that. That's not exact, but it's close. And if you go up one fret, third string, fourth fret, let me start over. On the fourth string, the fifth fret, I might have said fourth, those two should sound alike. And then go up one, fourth string, fourth fret, go up another one and down one, third string, uh, second string, third fret, and the second string and the first string should sound alike. And then when you get to the first string, you go back to the fifth fret and the fifth and the first string at the fifth fret should sound like the first string, I mean like the fifth string open. That's harder to say than it is to do. It's just basically this. Let me see if I can get my fingers out of the way and do that. I do it this way. And then this way. That's relative tuning. It doesn't have to be in G. I, I play a lot of these short neck banjos. Because they have a shorter neck, they're going to be in something like a, an A or something like that because the strings are shorter. But the relative tuning is the same. If I start at the fifth, uh, fifth fret on the fourth string and work my way down and tune them, they're going to be in tune just the same. That's enough of a lesson for one day. I'll have to go back and listen to this and see if I said everything right. Because it's harder to say it for me than it is to do it. Y'all have a nice day.